jumps now. When are you gonna jump? <laughs> What's going on over here? She's holding me hostage. This is what happens when I don't give her proper attention and she wants to go outside. <laughs> I don't want her to go outside because it's raining. So this is what she does. She smothers me. She's falling asleep. You're so sweet. So good, maybe? It's not so great for my neck, but... <laughs> you look so comfortable. <laughs> Won't that love or drink her be bad? 
back start and go let's try it one time All that snow will be gone, and we can go up there again. And I'll take you there and show you what I wanted to show you. I'm warm blooded. I'm gonna tell you guys a quick story about my wife. Back in high school, we used to try to get her to ditch, and she wouldn't do it because she was a goody. Because I would get in trouble. Because she was a goody school. two shoes. But but <laughs> not that long ago. I'll say it was more than seven years ago, for the sake of uh, statute limit uh, limitations. <laughs> but we went and looked at a foreclosed home, a bank owned home. It was in pretty rough shape. And my wife found this and she took it. That's how much she likes these things, okay? okay. The one law my wife has broken in her life revolves around these little things no, here. That one is from my grandpa's house. That's what I'm saying. The other ones that we have are When you see in one, you have to have it. Box. She tried to get me to, to climb a one of these poles on the side of a railroad track one time by our friend's house because she wanted an insulator <laughs> so bad. That is not too much to ask somebody. <laughs> okay. This is an old power line. This is how they would string the power lines. They'd have the isolate, the insulators would keep the electrical lines. This is probably close to 80, 80, 90 years old. I think they used them 20s, 30s, probably even 
maybe even into the 40s in some rural places. I got this from... from foreclosed home? I didn't steal it. <laughs> I got this when I went with my buddy Josh Pilch and we went and cleaned up a, an old abandoned farm. If you look far enough back in our videos, I made a few videos about it. I've been saving this for the right place to put it. And I'm hoping that I can do this in a way where, where Cedar likes it on the back porch. Across the back of the house here, I wanna make a little place to hang stuff. So I am gonna cut this down to seven posts because it's too wide and because we like the number seven. Uh, and I'm gonna hang it there on the wall before I do the board and batten. Take your precious. These are precious. Look how beautiful they are. My grandpa had like 50 of them, that's why I took yeah. them. Yeah, look what else your grandpa had. I know, that's why I like my your grandpa. Your grandma got rid of that. <laughs> <laughs> no. About 10 days after he passed away. Let's talk about stuff, like your shop. No, 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 what we're done, we're done talking. I'm gonna work <laughs> yeah, on this now. Yeah, of course, of course. You're, you're helping me get rid of it. We took a load to the dump yesterday. You're helping me get through it. <laughs> Okay, I'll holler at you when I'm ready for you. Okay. Thank you. I love you and your insulators, by the way. And my stuff. I love you more. You love me Just more like you love me and my stuff. <laughs> you love me more than insulators? Uh-huh. We are rapidly approaching springtime. My tulips are starting to come up in the front. Um, we have these days where it's warm and it, we're, we get excited that summer's gonna be close. And then all of a sudden a gust of wind comes in, it's freezing cold. It's like bone chilling cold. When my toes are cold, it gets cold. It can be zero degrees outside or even colder and be completely tolerable. Even 10, 10 below is not horrible if you're dressed appropriately. But the second the wind picks up, it changes everything. I think the ambient temperature is like 33 or 34 degrees outside right now, but it feels horrible. It feels way, way, way colder and it just makes it difficult to, to get anything done. And so. we also don't get wind very often. So when we yeah. do, it's like, uh, 50 to 60 mile, from? yeah, 50 to 60 mile an hour gusts is what are predicted all through the rest of the day, so. You can hang your seasonal decor from this. Seasonal. So like you get a bunch of reeds and a bunch of stuff? Like half of the, four of them are yours, three of them are mine. No? Wait, how many are yours? Three of the pegs are mine with my decor, four are yours. I'll put my old overalls and my do old... Do something really cute, like huh? an like a, a old wreath or something? Sure, like a... an old wreath. Come all you young rounders And a story I'll tell Of the promise of heaven And the warning of hell but Take heed where you ramble Or too soon you will go Way up on the hill flowers grow Early met in the springtime The sun sang 
Two star-crossed lovers In the still melting snow Where the loving was easy And the courting was brief There they called her a beauty They called him a thief In the quiet of the evening steal away where the laughter would flow and the fiddle would play where the folks called it wrong that's amazing bye I love you you guys good? Good. Good. thanks Boudreaux have fun, kiddos. The soup is on the counter. I put more stuff Turn it off this I time? Turn it off. You're going to have to turn it back on to warm it up. Bye. Love you guys. Bye. I love you. Brad, if you want to cut the bread up and cook it. Cut. Bye. I love you. See ya. But hell, it seemed all wrong. In the sun painted picture. And the day turned to night. Come up on the hillside. Bring the kisses, honey. I'll bring the wine. Keep your heart guarded, or too soon it'll fall. When one walks back home, honey, only one knows it all. Well, she walked up the hillside. Heart is a hunter, always knows of its prey. And her father's old pistol hanging loose by her side. When she aimed once, she never shot twice. Well, the air was so still. Sky was so blue before she could see them. The laughter she knew. She heard two shots ring out down in the town. There was three on the hillside, but only one headed down. I was just a baby, but I remember that day. When I walked up the hills, saw two mounds of clay. I'll always remember, and I'll never go back up the hill. Where the new flowers grow Back up the hillside Where the new flowers grow I'm done for the day. It's cold, it's late. I just ran out of the shorter screws that I like to use on the batten strips, so I'm gonna stop for now. Tomorrow, I'm gonna finish this little section up. I'm gonna put the tin on, even though there's a good likelihood that uh, I'm gonna take it off. I'm gonna finish it up because I know it may be a month or two before I uh, even dive into that. But the next step is that front porch. I'm gonna tear that front porch off and then I'm going to remove the siding. I'm gonna rebuild the front porch, finish the siding, and then continue the rest of the siding and hopefully get this done in a fairly timely manner. The good news is I bought the tin in November because the price of steel was going up so fast at that time that I was concerned 
that it would be 20, 30% more in the springtime. So I have the tin here. I'll have to go pick up some underlayment, but I couldn't be happier with how this is turning out. The look, it's worth the time and the headache to go through every piece of wood to figure out what is gonna work where. I've, I've had a number of you guys let me know that literally you can bleach stain out of wood. My concern is that it might lighten the wood up too much, but I'm gonna play around with that as well and see what that does. Oh, I ain't gonna live like this no more Most of my life's been waging war Till I found peace, I could've swore What she did shook me to the core And I ain't gonna live like that no more 